FSB。Hi Stephen, thanks for taking the time to go through our 17 questions brought to you by FSB and Dell Technologies. It's great to be here today. Welcome, it's nice to have you. So, how would you sum up Pocket Creatives in one sentence?、Uh, well, we are a small and friendly creative team based in London. Why the name Pocket Creatives? Well, I wish I had a better answer for you, other than the fact that we had loads of names going left, right, and centre over the course of a couple of months,、um, and we woke up with this one one morning and it stuck. What services do you currently offer? Uh, we offer video production and still photography. What would you say is the thing that makes Pocket Creatives unique? Unique is really, really hard to find in our line of work. So we tend to focus more on our quality of service. We like to give our clients、um, an enjoyable process from start to finish, and ultimately that's why they come back. Did you always dream of owning your own business? Uh, yes, I did.、Um, actually, this is my third business.、Um, I started、uh, when I came out of uni,、um, and I've been through everything from sort of broadcast through to quite heavy corporate video and、uh, internal communications. What was the inspiration to start Pocket Creatives?、Um, well, off the back of doing a lot of internal-based work,、um, Pocket was、um, came out of the need to do more for social media, for websites, and、um, actually a lot more outwardly facing promotional-based work.、Uh, kind of look around. How do you stay up to date with the latest industry trends and advancements?、Mm. Uh, staying up with、um, with trends can be quite difficult, and actually, my、um, uh, very over full inbox is testament to that. So I tend to subscribe to lots of emails, lots of newsletters,、um, and I use a bookmarking service as well for when、uh, I can't read anything right now, but I know that I need to at some point. How do you see AI shaping the future of video production? Um, AI is an interesting one. We're all getting more used to that as a term now, and we're finding different ways to integrate it into、uh, lives, whether that be marketing or anything creative. At the moment, it's probably still too early for us to know and really understand how it's going to fit in to give everybody some benefits. So, do you view it as a benefit or a challenge?、Um, I'd say it's a bit of both at the moment. There will be benefits. It's up for up to us to find them ultimately and marry. Uh, the sort of the automation side of that,、um, with the fact that we're all still humans, and that's what、um, what people want from us when we're delivering a service. And what advice would you give to small business owners who are considering investing in video production and photography for their brand? I think certainly in 2023,、um, any investment in anything has got to be considered, and it's got to deliver some results, isn't it?、Um, so keeping an eye on what your end result is is probably、uh, the best advice that I can give. Closely followed by try your best to get a brief together. Try to work out what it is you think that you need and what you want,、um, but also don't be afraid to lean on the experts that you're reaching out to because they'll be able to help、um, really get the best out of that brief. Give us another trend in video production or visual marketing that people should look out for in the near future. I think trends are a tough one.、Um, you know, we've all seen Insta Stories, we've all seen、uh, TikTok coming in,、um, but they tend to come and go and they rise and fall when other trends come in to kind of knock them out of the way as well. So we probably say, don't work too hard on the trends. Go back to thinking about what it is that you need to achieve, and then again, relying on the company that you've, you've commissioned to work with you. Um, to help find the right tools and the right outlet to deliver your project. So there's no denying the role that tech has had in your business. How has it helped you streamline your business and workloads? Well,、uh, tech for us,、um, you know, fits in in, in everything we do, from the、uh, camera choices to、uh, what lighting we use, sound equipment.、Um, but there's also a huge amount of software that we use to book in our work, to collaborate between、uh, members of the team. Um, for our sales and marketing processes,、um, as well as our work delivery as well. What is your biggest tech challenge? <laughs> biggest tech challenge is really keeping on top of, of、uh, all the things that we currently have, as well as what's coming next. Are we still shooting on the best equipment?、Um, are we needing to change anything in the near future to accommodate things like shooting more vertical rather than shooting in landscape, as we've always sort of typically done? So keeping on top of all that is a real challenge. Can you share a memorable project that you've worked on recently? Yeah, well, one of the standout projects recently、uh, has been for an educational-based company, which involved、uh, travel over to Denmark,、um, and we really enjoy travelling. I didn't get to go myself, unfortunately, but、um, it's always a really nice perk for the team when they get to go and see other places alongside、uh, working on the project. How do you capture your clients' vision and brand in your filming? Uh, there's a lot around、um, quite sort of heavy pre-production, understanding what clients really need and what the outcome of the project. Needs to be as well. We can do loads to make sure that things are on brand, but ultimately, it's all about making sure that that video, all those stills, feel like they belong to that particular brand that we're producing that work for. And what does being an FSB member mean to you? 
Being part of the FSB has been really, really helpful. Um, I mean, ultimately, it's, it's all being um, part of that knowledge base, really, that you can afford to tap into when you don't necessarily have dedicated expertise in-house, particularly when we are a small team. What's next for Pocket Creatives? Next for us, um, we've worked really hard to win some really, really cool projects that are happening this summer, so it's going to be a nice few months to look forward to. Thank you, Stephen, for having us here today for our 17 Questions video series with FSB and Dell Technologies. It's been a pleasure. And it's been really nice to have you here. Thanks so much for coming. And it's actually been really good practice being in front of the camera for a change. FSB.